Hello guys, welcome to my workshop. And uh, in this video I'm going to show you another uh, homemade repeater system using uh, this uh, radio. This is a um, Bendix King LMH3142 uh, Alpha. And uh, I'm going to use two of this in conjunction with uh, my uh, homemade uh, squash triggered repeater system as in a part one of the video, okay? Okay now, as uh, with other uh, repeater system, we need two radios here. We have one for uh, receive and one and the other one is for transmit. And as with my older or my previous uh, video on a homemade uh, squelch trigger that repeater, well the heart of this uh, project is this uh, called triggered device which is a uh, really uh, controlled this is the relay switch accompanied with two two uh, transistors this is a driver transistor so we got two of them and as usual we wired uh, this uh, trigger we have here uh, the, uh, the squash top here. With the IC MC3357D. And uh, right here we have uh, the trigger out. Alright, here's the switch. The trigger out connected to the uh, transmitter here. And this one here, this one is the uh, audio output connected to the transmitter uh, microphone input. And the uh, right one here is the program, program switch. Well, this is the only modification I uh, made uh, to this radio because this uh, radio, the LMH3142 Alpha of Bendix King, uh, needs a program cable or rather programming cable in order to uh, save the frequency and other uh, functionalities and into its memory, okay? We need a programming cable, but then I tried to hack this radio so that we don't uh, we don't be needing the uh, cable anymore, and I just added the uh, program switch here. So uh, all you have to do is uh, press the program uh, switch here together with a function key, and then you go to the programming mode. And as usual, we have here the. Uh, patch cord we have one for the uh, this one is for the uh, squelch trigger connected to the uh, right to the receiver its output is to the transmitter and uh, this one is for the uh, audio patch well um, connected to the uh, Receiver again, and this one is connected. The output is connected to the transmitter. Now to test this project, uh, first thing first, we have to program uh, all the frequencies and all the settings uh, and the functionalities into its memory and the program this thing um, you have to uh, push the uh, program switch here this is the uh, hack on this project okay so you have to program you have to push this program switch uh, for about five seconds while pushing uh, while pressing the function key 
then there you have it. Uh, you now have entered the uh, program mode, and here, pressing the function, you'll see several of the settings. So now I have entered the uh, input frequency, or rather the receive frequency. It's 162 decimal 300 uh, megahertz in a 2 meter band. And uh, the transmit frequency is 148 decimal 20 megahertz, 2 meter band. All right, so um, you can uh, get the uh, full uh, operations manual on the internet or uh, it is explained also on my website at http manadigusmanartist.com so uh, we have to uh, turn off the radio and back again to be able to use this radio in, uh, in its operational mode and uh, once you uh, restart the radio it will show the channel 1 on its uh, display and here's the uh, transmitter also. So the frequency will not be displayed on the, the operational mode. And at the test this project, I have connected a uh, SWR meter, which I also use to, as a power meter. And uh, to trigger this uh, repeater system, I'm gonna use again my ICOM V68 radio here. So when I press the uh, transmit of this portable, as you can see, uh -huh, it's uh, triggering the uh, uh, transmit, or rather, the receive and then the, it's retransmitting my uh, audio here, audio check, one, two, three, so now it's working. One, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. So uh, this project is actually uh, a modification of uh, the Bendix King LMH3142 uh, base uh, mobile VHF radio. Okay, now it's the final test. Uh, let's try to uh, monitor some uh, frequency and uh, Let's see if uh, this device can trigger uh, the transmit of this repeater, okay. I'm gonna put this uh, receiver into a scan uh, function. And let's try to see. Monitor it here at the uh, Icon V68. Total audio solutions.